Get paid, get laid. Get laid, get paid. All right, dude, we're back at it today. It's the little one drop, dude. We're going after a bracelet again. We had to shake off the 3K, okay? We made a deep run. We battled with Daniel Negranos. You know what? I, I, I ran it all off, okay? Whatever, dude. The man moves on. The man moves on. Dude, if every tournament, if luck wasn't involved in every tournament, dude, the mans would win every one, okay? We got to let the fish have some so they stick around in the world of poker. But today, we're about to crush the little one drop, all right? Um, now let's go register, and then we're going to try to get on the featured table. What's up here? I'm here for my big interview with Poker News, and uh, I heard you want to check out some of the man's blockers right here. Dude, everyone needs blockers. I just did a video yesterday about blockers, and I was like trying to make a sun blue blocker joke, and uh, no one got it. And now you know what? Look at that. You're looking fly as hell now. Future's so bright. I need some fucking sun blue blockers. That's right. This shit's all good, trying to get in. The sun never sets on crushing. Mm -mm. Now I'm planning a one drop a little later. Are there any questions you want to ask me as the heavy favorite in this field? Yes, um, I want to. Ask you, what are you gonna buy with all your winnings? Well, this is my thing. I got, I got my private jet, so we're gonna fly the ladies out. We're probably gonna go to the Bahamas, and uh, we're gonna get you out there. We're and gonna some get blue you. blockers for everyone. That's right, free blockers for everybody. Excellent, excellent. Anything else? Anything else you gotta ask me? I'm just gonna run up a chip lead and then take it down, and it's for charity. It's for a good cause. Yeah, that's too. true. It's for charity. Also, I'm gonna start a charity that everyone can donate to. It's called Auntie Chardonnay is thirsty and needs money and is poor. Help me. Excellent, help. excellent. We'll get her an Indie Go Go with Kickstarters. We'll hook it up. I can get you some cash too. I'm kind of flush with you it. You think you can? I, I can see. We I got can the tell. blank. We got the blank. Tell. And when's the album dropping? Excellent. Oh, anytime now. Anytime. I got a bunch of them. I'll, I'll have a few mixtapes out. Will you tell everybody get paid, get laid for? Pete Manzanelli? Uh, get paid, get laid. All right, dude. The one drop, it's an $1,100 buy-in. Some of the money goes to charity, which is great. I always, denote, I always donate most of my winnings to charity anyway, so this is great to get everybody else to do the same like man's. We're going to go in and register right now. Let's do it. Registering for the one drop? Yeah. You're so dressed up today. Thank you, dude. Is this yeah. also where I pick up the bracelet when I win? Uh, I think they're gonna give you over there. Okay, but... just wondering where I need to go after I win. Oh, so you're swimming now, huh? Exactly, dude. <laughs> Gotta have confidence. Right, you look confident, you Thank know. You, you have your aviator, you know. That's right, the blockers, dude. <laughs> and your tank top. That's right. It's hot in here, dude. It's oh hot. my god, yeah, it's hot. <laughs> you look different than your picture, though. I know, dude. This is just, it's a former self. It's my old self. I'm a oh, man now. Oh. I'm a man. <laughs> really? Is that for a better or what? Yeah, I think so. Mm. Yeah, this is the new and improved. Really? New and improved Pete Man's Man. Do you have abs? That's why. Yeah, dude. You want me to? You want me to show you my? Oh abs? yeah, of course. Dude, okay, dude, I'll show you my abs. Oh my god. All right, dude. Yeah, you need a little more work, you know. <laughs> That's right. Yeah. Why are you giving that to you're, almost, you're so flustered, dude. You always I, I, gave me the money I, back. I am flustered now, really. Because of the abs, you know? That's right, dude. Hey, I understand. You're only human, dude. You're only human. I know, right? I, I'm vulnerable, you know? Awesome. Thanks, dude. Appreciate it. Okay. Have a good one, dude. Keep that mental image in your head all day. Oh, my God. I don't know how much of that we got on uh, on recording, but let's just say I went to register for the one drop, and the guy at the register started hitting on me, asked me to show him my abs, which I did happily, and then he tried to give me my money back because he was so flustered. Just another day in the man's life, baby. Advice. I'm here with Jamie Staves. He, he tracked me down in the halls of the Rio. He says, Mans, I want to interview you before you go crush the one drop. Can I, can I please interview you, but also can you film it and put it up on your website? Exactly. Yeah, exactly. So it's just kind of a mutually beneficial thing, dude. But uh, it's been an honor for you to interview me, I'm sure. Is there any other questions you have? I am honored, and I just want to know what I could do to be more like you. I don't know, dude. I think you start wearing the sunblockers, dude. Um, start saying get paid, get laid more. And uh, if you need some kind of commentary tips on there, it kind of gets a little dry with you guys sometimes. I could come in there, spice it up in the middle seat. Uh, I'm gonna reverse it and say get laid, get paid. I like it. All right, dudes, I've been told I'm at the one drop uh, featured table. Let's head into the Brasilia room and check it out.
Yo, what's up, dude? So here's the deal. I was told I was at the feature tables for the one drop. I go in there, dude. I get turned away. They say, no, this is for the main event, which is some bullshit, dude, because I've thought a lot about this, dude, in the main event, it's like a top prize, $8 million, whatever, and none of it goes to charities, dude. The man's gives away at least 50% of all of his winnings to charities, the little one drop, it's a charity tournament, as well as a bracelet, which is like what I like to call killing three birds with one stone, dude. So to everybody in them sleeping at night with like that on your conscience, knowing that like you're not playing for charities, and that makes you kind of like selfish and a bad person, whereas the man's, dude, he likes to give back, dude, I've been blessed so much in life and I like to get back so I'm just chilling here uh, a few minutes before I head to my seat dude to play the one drop to win the one drop and yeah they're just chilling uh, it's been a great trip uh, my quest for a bracelet uh, continues right now all right dudes we're a little short stacked on the first break dude down to 6,500 chips, but I just picked up some snacks, dude. We got spicy nuts, because that's what's gonna happen to the cards when they come to me, dude. I'm gonna have the spicy nuts, dude. Let's go. Well, fam, we busted out of the one drop. Very disappointing. Um, I came to the World Series of Poker to win a couple of bracelets to make our giveaway winners, Jason's and Johnny Ringo's some money, and drape bracelets around my cock. And I failed to do that. Don't get me wrong, I've balled out. I've lived a life, I've done autographs, I've kissed babies, I've signed titties, like, I've done it all. I've hobnobbed with the biggest stars and the richest people in all of Las Vegas, but feeling empty inside right now that first bracelet still eludes me I feel like I need to do something to prove to my fans that I am larger than life and that's why right now I'm gonna prove to you all that I exist on a higher plane that I can do things that nobody else can do watch me right now walk on water Yo, dude, I just realized that Chippendales is at the real, dude. It's like a spin-off of that SNL sketch with Chris Farley and David Spade. Pretty tight. <laughs> 